I was born and raised in this area. My family um, actually own a vineyard up on Sonoma Mountain. Being from Sonoma County, I kind of gravitated towards the Russian River Valley, one of the coolest parts of Sonoma County. We're out here on the crush pad, and it's an exciting time of year for us, uh, middle of September. We're, um, we've gotten started just about two weeks ago picking grapes. Uh, we're right in the heart of our Pinot Noir season. You can see how dark, how dark red, almost black, the, the skins are at this stage. For the last several weeks, I've been walking each and every row, uh, every other day, just following the maturity of flavor, basically tasting skins, looking at the seeds. We're trying to optimize these sites and understand their potential, unlock their potential. You're looking for a sweetness to the skins. You're looking for them to, to transition from being acidic and bitter to being soft and sweet and having a nice kind of tactile character. The climate is, is often the most important driver in terms of the varietals that are planted. And in this cool area, you couldn't ripen Cabernet Sauvignon and would have a hard, hard time ripening Merlot, where Pinot Noir and Chardonnay are ideal for this climate. And that's really what, our, what we're focusing on, because that's what this area does best. Those varietals being key to this area, I think that you develop an understanding, uh, having worked with them year after year, of what these sites can do from a qualitative standpoint. We're entering it at a very small production with all of the tools that we need to make the very best wines. We're finding our niche. We're looking to produce wines that are the ultimate expression, the highest quality. They're special because they're not mass produced. You know, you can't mass produce an antique. You, you can't mass produce uh, something that's of artisan quality. And that's what we're really trying to capture.